Listen, when I went through David's laptop, I found pictures of Rachel and Frank being more than friends. <laughs> right, no way, Max. She was just posing to tease Frank. If you're not gonna believe me, why don't we check out what Frank has in his RV? What's that gonna prove? Frank has Rachel's bracelet. What else does he have in there? Motherfucker better not have anything, for his sake. Let's check the door. Frank gets so wasted, he sometimes forgets to lock it. I can't believe you hung out with him. Not anymore. We have to be casual ninjas here. Shipples. Okay, here's the plan. I'll go to the diner and distract Frank by telling him I have his money, but he needs to come with me. Then you come in and rewind so Frank doesn't see me. Then you can tell Frank he needs to check out his RV, and then you rewind after you get the key, and, uh, and... Chloe, I got this. I'll be right back. Don't let my epic plan get in the way of yours. I'll try to scrounge up a Scooby snack to distract his mangy mutt. Now to find a quick and easy way to snag Frank's keys. Welcome back to Let's Play Life is Strange. More nasty this shit. is part 14, and we're breaking into an RV. Hopefully this is not his, uh, what was it that they called it in Breaking Bad? His, uh, domic something something domicile. There's the truck. Ooh, bird. What is going on here? Okay, let's uh, see what else we're doing around here. That's probably in the RV. Do I have to go talk to him? actually proud of her. It's good. I'm glad we saved Kate. Good lord, bacon. I'm ready to nosh again. <laughs> that will be fun to take a road trip to the drive-in with Warren. Max needs more fun. Wow. Ten dollars a car, that's actually not bad. That's a really good price. That actually sounds fun. <laughs> oh, Warren. Never mind me, officer. I'm just here to steal a drug dealer's keys. Oh, Nathan's here. Nathan has time to get drugs from Frank because he was expelled. We should stop and say hi. See how much we can anger him. If you can't tell, I really don't like him. But then again, I doubt anybody does. You show up after almost shooting me? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing like Rachel doesn't make you cool or tough. The fuck do you want? How do you know these are Rachel's clothes? Because she looks beautiful in them and you look <laughs> like ass. Aiming a gun doesn't make you any sexier. Grab your keys and let's check out your RV. Wow. Let's not. You fucking creep me out. In other words, Max, no keys. Maybe I could chat up that officer, or even Nathan, and then go all Groundhog Day on them until I get the info I need. We can try that. Ooh, we can spill his drink. <laughs> I just wanted to see what would happen if I did this. I'm gonna kill you. That was fun. <laughs> You 
eat like a pig. Try the floor. I was eating those beans. Are you fucking insane? I was eating those beans. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That was cool. That was amazing. Can we do that to Nathan? Oh, I hope we can. Rachel? Uh, whatever the fuck. Uh. Oh, look. Max Amber. Nice outfit. <laughs> By the way, thanks for getting me fucking expelled, you twee bitch. You're lucky this is a public place. Considering we're in a public diner with a police officer right over there, you shouldn't advertise your rage, Prescott. Oh, yeah? You shouldn't have bitch snitched on me to that fucked up principal. Ooh. He doesn't care about Kate. He's, he's just... No. Hmm. Drugs. Listen, Nathan. I'll take back everything I said about you. If you hook me up with Frank. Know what I mean? You look like you've never even taken a hit of baby aspirin. How do you think I stay wired all night studying? So is it a deal or not? Calm down, hard up. Deal. You'll get your school supplies. Just go over to Frank and whisper, higher education. You'll hook your ass up. Try interrogating somebody else, Lieutenant Caulfield. We're gonna rhyme and keep the information. Make sure that doesn't get around. If he happens to uh, go to David or his lawyer or something like that, it might not end well for us. One more time. You eat like a pig. Try the floor. I was eating those beans. Are you fucking insane? I was eating those beans! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is too good. No more of that now. You show up after almost shooting me? You have serious balls, little girl. But hanging out with Chloe, playing with guns, and dressing like Rachel. D uh, we'll see what this does. By the way, Frank, I was wondering if you had any um, higher education. <laughs> oh yeah, sure. Do you want the after-school special to go with that? <sighs> Jesus. Look, I don't sell anything but bottles to feed me and my dog. I work for a living. Not like you spoiled Blackwell punks with too much time on your hands. But... But nothing. Don't ever ask me for anything ever again. Ever. And I'll back off. That didn't work, so... Yeah, she's probably gonna be interested in the dad. No, we've already spilled his stuff enough. Could I get you to drop Chloe's debt? Are you supposed to be a smart student? You'll find out if you do me this favor. Thanks, Godmother. But I don't need your favors. And Chloe doesn't get any from me. Huh. I guess we have to uh, talk to the cop then. There she is, Super Maxine. That's your new nickname around the bay. Sorry, but you did earn it. We're all real proud of you for helping Kate down. Thanks, Officer Barry. I was just lucky. And right on time. Kate is who counts. I'm glad you're representing Blackwell Academy. I'm so happy she's okay. I guess Kate Marsh will be the face of Blackwell for a while. And you for helping her. That's the kind of school spirit we need more of. I thought Nathan Prescott represents Blackwell. Well, don't make me backwash this <laughs> bacon. You know what the Prescotts represent. Taking over Arcadia Bay? You're not far wrong, Max. 
I heard the Prescotts are working on some new big land deals. Mr. Prescott helped out my family once a while ago, so I made a deal with him that I can't seem to get out of. Man, if I could get one instant replay in life. I better finish my breakfast first. I don't think we got anything useful out of that, so. Let's talk to him some more. There she is. Thanks, Officer Barry. I'm glad you're representing Black. Hmm. Do you think Arcadia Bay is a weird town? I'd take a normal city with normal problems about now. Makes me sick thinking about it. Huh. Well, I heard a rumor you were working for the Prescott family on the side. Jesus, doesn't this town ever shut up? I don't blame you for getting extra work. Look, sometimes I check up on the Prescott family to make sure they're doing all right. Nathan included. Keep this quiet, Max. There she is. Thanks, officer. I'm glad you're up. Uh, can we get any more? Well, I heard a rumor no. you were working. Jesus. I don't. Bl OK, I guess we'll go talk to Nathan then. Right. Hmm. Let's see what this gets us. I heard your dad hired a local cop to keep an eye out on you and Frank Bowers. Like a babysitter. Bullshit! My dad doesn't hire. He owns. And these pigs know better than to knock on me. Do they? I hope that means Frank won't get busted. Eventually he will. Guy's into some freaky shit. He told me once he took a weird blood oath for mm. Rachel. Uh, forget I told you that. Seriously. Now get off my crack, whore. Keep your pie holes shut. Well, let's see if we can use that then. What the fuck now? By the way, Frank. Oh, no. I was one... <laughs> but... But nothing. Get a new outfit. And leave me alone. Nope. I'm not leaving you alone. I shouldn't have said that. I'll need to rewind. What the fuck now? Okay. Hmm. That didn't work. Are you fucking stupid? Get out of my space. Damn, I really pissed him off. I need to go back. Are you fucking stupid? Get out of my space. I shouldn't have said that. I'll need to rewind. Rachel! Weren't you supposed to keep your mouth shut about the blood oath Frank took for Rachel? Blood oath? Who? What the fuck? I never told anybody about that freaky shit. Besides, everybody knows Frank is a liar and a loser. Even Rachel did. Yet Rachel Amber hung out with him more than you. So? Rachel wanted Frank's stash. She let him take pictures, then he carries around her photo like she posed for love. Dumbass. Okay, let's see if we can use that now. What the fuck now? Ooh. You know I saw that photo Rachel gave you. Uh, uh, how do you know about that? Huh? Chloe, right? She just told me that one of Rachel's favorite pictures was the one she did for you. Really? Yeah, I mean, that's what I thought. She was just a natural beauty, you know? Wait, wait, let me, let me find it. Here. 
Judge for yourself. Wow. That worked out really well. Gonna take these? I'm afraid I'll have to take your keys now, asshole. Wow. You did not just do that. Give me back my keys, bitch. Give me my keys now! I'm keeping the keys, though. Key brought. Now back to Chloe. Oh. Uh, that is so... Wow. <laughs> Are you shitting me? I'm gonna go help her. Are you shitting me? Are you Can I not warn her here? Alyssa, watch out! Quit thinking, Max. Got it. Whew. That was close, Alyssa. Okay, Max. This is the third time you've saved me from harm's way. You must be my angel. Don't thank me. I haven't done anything special. You've paid your dues by saving Kate's life on the roof. You really are a Blackwell hero, Max. No, I'm just lucky. If Kate wanted to jump, she could have. Well, she didn't because she had a friend who cared enough to help. I hope everybody at Blackwell starts caring. Amen to that. Max, we should get a posse to see her in the hospital when they allow visitors. Let's hang later and talk some more. Okay, time to break in. Careful, Max. Cujo ahead. Don't hurt the dog. I should have known. The amazing spider, Max. I couldn't have done it without Frank. Now let's get in and out. You'll need this, Max. On your mark, get set. Throw! Parking lot, not toward the road. What is wrong with that? Get the treat, treat, boy. I think we just made that dog our bitch. Get it? Now we can snoop in peace. But let's not waste time. Who would throw that toward the road? That is... The doggy is busy now, but... He might come back. I'm not hurting the dog. Damn. I thought my room was a shithole. You're not a creepy drug dealer. Yet. Frank has issues, but he's not creepy. At least I didn't think so until I saw him with Rachel's bracelet. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading down the coast of Big Sur and beyond? Yes, we'd be tearing up the highway. And you'd probably want me to kiss you again. Chloe, we're on a schedule. We need clues about Rachel. I know. Just daydreaming. So I take it Max is going to be uh, Heisenberg here? <laughs> Chloe would be would fit pretty well as You scope the area while I hack his computer for info. Zip, nada, nothing. Frank is almost a made for TV hoarder. This place is nasty. I doubt Frank is trying out for the Arcadia Bay Brewers. Candy bar. Of course Frank gets the munchies. Of course. Nice rig. Glad Frank treats something here with respect. Seems like he treats his dog pretty well, so there's that. Good to know Frank has a knife lying around. Most people at the kitchen do. Crappy what? Frank must spend all his drug money on baggies. <laughs> Recycle, dude. Okay, this vent is loose. I need something to pry it open. A knife? This is almost as good as a set of keys. I'm not touching that bed. Eh, I will look. 
Is Frank going to deal online now? Possibly. That's a pretty extreme lighter. Are these for Frank or is he selling them? Or both? Too bad I don't have my Frank Bowers decoder ring. I don't want to know. Curses! Nothing here. You're gonna fix the knife. No more secrets. I'm pretty sure it was that first vent we saw. That's almost cute to see Frank posing with his dog. Which is why I'm glad we didn't hurt it. And I am not going to hurt it. My blade will open any portal. This is his own... Oh man. Rachel and Frank's dog. This is his own private domicile, and he will not have his rights violated. I don't know if I should be touched or disturbed. Wow. Um, I... I don't know if I should show this to Chloe. She will not take it well. I'm glad Rachel got to drive this beast. She looks genuinely happy. Rachel really did hang out with Frank. I'm learning more about Rachel than I want to know. Hmm. Trouble in paradise. Is she seriously citing her zodiac sign based on how she handles some of this? Ugh. Well, time to show this to Chloe. It makes me ill that Rachel posed like this for Frank. I wrote him love letters. I can't believe she was banging Frank. Rachel straight up lied to my face. Why didn't she say anything? Because she knew how you would react. And she wasn't much of a friend, huh? Just another person who shits all over me. Why does everybody in my life let me down? My dad gets killed, you bail on me for years. My mother gloms on a step fucker. Now Rachel betrays me. Chloe, Rachel is missing. Nobody betrayed you. Bullshit. You totally defended Step Stalker. Fuck everybody. Chloe! Chloe, you can't keep blaming me and everybody for everything wrong in your life. It's so not fair. I gotta blame somebody, otherwise it's all my fault. Fuck that. She finally realizes. We'll try and help though. It's just life. Shit happens. It's nobody's fault. Blah blah blah, as Mr. Jefferson would say. And, and Kate Marsh... Yes, Kate Marsh almost killed herself. Such sad, okay? That doesn't make me feel any better about my fucked up life. Get it? So who do you most want to blame? My fucking dad, of course. Hello? Why? You blame William? Really? Yes, I do. Damn right. He chose to go out that door and leave me forever. Chloe, your dad didn't choose to leave you. I know that, Max. My mom actually blames herself just because she wanted a ride home from work. Sometimes even I blame her. 
No, you don't. Yes, Max, I do. Do you know what it's like to wait for your father to come home when you're a kid? And he never does? No, of course not. But I was with you that day. It was just a terrible accident. I wish that made me feel better. But ever since he died, my life has been dipped in shit. And you blame him for this? You don't want to hear this, but you're still here. Alive. With me. And that is no accident. You're right. I don't want to hear this. Chloe, I can't do this out on my own. I need you with me. And Rachel needs you. She just... she probably... Oh my god, what is happening now? Okay. on its own now. Okay. Someday dad will get one of them newfangled computers. I hope, the Flash... I hope the Flash didn't scare you, Max. This is a keeper. Not until I see it first. You know the rules, dad. Max, tell him. Whoa, hey. You look totally pale. Are you okay? Yeah. I just... Uh... Yeah, I'm fine. Okay, Chloe. Give me the thumbs up or thumbs down. Well... I might just allow this one into the family album. No. You're the boss. What is this? But not the cook. William can't is can't here. Daddy. Yes, and we can't. Chloe is just a kid. And serve us slackers. Am I that far back in friends. time? You mean pancakes? In France, they call them. Crepes. I'm 18 years and old inside my 13-year-old self. If you want to eat. Breakfast. How? We. Oui. I volunteer to break the eggs. This is gonna get weird, isn't it? Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. That's true. So, how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? What a mess we made. I remember those cool drawings I did with I'll Chloe. Chloe was so into manga. Nice hair. It's Chloe from the future. Oh no. Uh, hatch has been moved. Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. What? Joyce loves William so much. 
Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come oh. pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Okay, I get what's going on. You're going to keep him from getting killed. Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. You can't move. That's him. true. Oh? So how many eggs? Don't you dare oh. question the Boom. chef. Disconnected. Like you're the real cook here. I am. When your mom is away. Does that work? I'll let her know that. Hey, that might have worked. Ooh, photo. What? Hey, honey. Okay, so I guess you can't stop. Don't you dare call. question the chef. Right. Now I get to take a picture. Strike a pose. Make me a star. Just make me look young. Like you're the real cook here? I'm glad we were able to do that. Okay. I am. When your mom is away. Can't get rid of that. I'll let her so. know that. Car keys? Where are they? Sorry, wrong number. Oh. Max, come on, you know better than that. Hello? Hey, honey. Nope, that's not gonna work. Phone staying plugged in. It's not really gonna get us anything. Where does he hide the keys? Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. I have to stop William from taking his car today. Ladies, I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious grub for us to feast upon. You are upon. ridiculous. <laughs> You'll be grateful for that someday. Okay. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. I'm gonna do this just because. Okay, where is where, where are his keys? Uh -huh. Ah, okay. Be grateful for that, some. I'm gonna go back and hide those. We can't get rid of the phone. You're the real cook here. We can get the key. I am. When your mom is away. What? Let me. I'll let her know let me that. Move them. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I miss movie nights here. Cookies and popcorn. Okay. Can I uh, not move the keys? Do you remember how many eggs? Mom said it depends. That's true. So how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? Can I not move his keys? I am. When your mom is away? I'll let her know that. You know that won't work. Remember how many eggs? Boop. That's true. That's so how many eggs? Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here. Why can't I move the keys? I am. When your mom is away. I'll let her know that. I know they're here. Come on. This phone. Hey, honey. I, I have no idea why the home phone didn't ring just now. I'm just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the Two Whales. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come pick you up. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. 
That's a cool snow doe. Excuse me, ladies. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the Save Mart. She doth have many bags of delicious gro- For that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund. That's not going to go too far. Can I just stand in front of them and keep them from getting there? Please? Oh, nope. Aha! You can't hide from me oh. forever. Now lock up after I leave. Play nice. Try not to destroy too much of the house. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting uh. session. Dad! Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world-famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max, you'll be here too, right? She's never leaving me. That makes all of us. Okay, come on. Come on. Okay. We should know where they are. Faithful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college Score. Friend? Keys, please. Four keys? Shit, where are those keys? Another dollar for the swear jar. Did that work? You're bankrupting. I know I had those keys right here. I know it. Did it? Forgot all about you, little buddy. Release the keys. Of course. Of course. Last time I ordered from Spy Guy Electronics. You can take the bus, right? The stop is right down the street. This I can do. Good call, Max. Oh, yeah. The bus is great. We did it. It comes every it, 15 Max. minutes, and, and there'll be plenty of room for you and no, joys no. and groceries stop. and... Stop. And it'll save the environment. Uh, this is weird. You sold me already. I'm off to yonder bus stop. Uh, Joyce will love this. That worked. Max, you are being so fucking strange. You feel Life okay? Strange. Chloe, I am awesome. We are awesome. <laughs> Come on. You are such a whole bag. I mean, you need to talk with that baby. I'm not paying $150 for a car. I heard that the Vortex Club parties are wild. Dude, the service fee is like 50%. Hello, are you even listening, Maxine? Uh, All my uh, friends in LA told me that Oregon was Max. wet and cold every day. But Never like Maxine. So that's why she was laughing so I know. Sorry, Mad Max. <laughs> You're not pissed at me, right? Right? Do you want to go hit the girls' potty and smoke a peace pipe? I think Max is hot. She's acting like so weird. You cool, Max? Nobody listened when I said we shouldn't let her in the vortex. Courtney, you don't want anybody in the club. Like whatever, bitch. What is Lauren. Going on? He hooked up with Stella? Yeah, they seem pretty happy together. Oh no! This is totally fucked up! What else have I changed? Chloe. He's still around. I wonder if he fights with Chloe still. But uh, this is going to be a bit long, but I think we're about at the end of the episode, so 
I'm just going to finish it up. What's going on? Is that a beach whale? Multiple ones? Oh. Wow. That's bad. Well, let's go see Chloe. Is she dead? Did something happen? Did they move? Hmm. Max Caulfield, taking a break after taking Seattle by storm, huh? He's alive. Hmm. We thought we'd never see you again after you left for the big city. No. I'd never do that to Chloe. Speaking of, I know she's been dying to see you. Hold on. Chloe! Chloe! You have a visitor! Happy to see us, so uh, I'm not sure what to do now. Okay, that looks like it's the end of episode three. Come on, statistics. Okay, I'm glad people left the money. Eh, this one would have been nicer in the short term, siding with Chloe, but honestly, she was kind of way over the line. Why did people hurt his dog? That is... No! That is not okay! We helped Warren. That's good, I guess. Wait... Is, is Lisa the plant? We're on the list. <laughs> yeah, we did erase some names. Yep. I'm glad we helped Alyssa. Wait, I didn't know... I didn't notice the homeless person. I guess that's what happened. Well, I did, but the constant... Redo's got rid of it. So that happened. Well, thank you for watching. This has been Let's Play Life is Strange, Episode 3. We'll be back later with Episode 4.